Hello everyone. Today we're going to split our screen using keyboard shortcuts. This is important because sometimes you'll want to have multiple web pages or tabs or applications open and this will allow you to easily split your screens using simply keystroke shortcuts. So if you notice I have a web page screen open, but I really want to also be able to access a note page that I have open. So on the Chromebook, you would press the Alt plus one of the bracket keys, either the right or left bracket. If you press the right bracket, it'll snap it to the right. If you press the left bracket with the Alt key, it will snap it to the left. So I'm going to go ahead and move that to the right. And if you notice, I'm going to do the same thing again, and I'm going to move it to the left. So either way, you know, you could do that all day, and it'll kind of give you a little bit of a queasy feeling if you keep doing that. But we're going to leave it locked to the left. And I'm going to open up a new screen that I have available, a Google Slide presentation. And we're going to lock that one to the the right. If you notice, we have it split so everything is awesome. Now, if you press present, it takes over the whole screen. So I want to look, have you look at the presentation for just a second. Like I said, with the Chromebook, you use the Alt and the bracket keys, either to snap to the left or to the right. Now, if you're on PC or Windows, you're going to press that Windows button that's kind of down there with the control and alt keys and then you're going to press the windows button and the right arrow to snap right and the windows button and the left arrow to snap left. So why would this even be useful? If you look at the possibility of having to take notes on something, for example, slideshow, a Nearpod that's shared, or a screencastify or YouTube video. So you might open up a document that allows you to take notes and you're going to want to snap it. And I can now take notes on this particular website and go back and forth between the screens and it doesn't cause one screen to cover up the other. It saves a lot of time. It is very efficient and allows you to be very productive. So that is how to split screens. Remember with the Chrome books, you use the alt and the bracket keys. 